The long-awaited Samsung Galaxy S8 has arrived at Appalachian Wireless. Get yours for the introductory price of just $149.99 with a two-year service agreement. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless and East Kentucky Network Company. Joined by other agencies from around the region, the Prestonsburg Police Department today staged a roundup of suspected drug dealers. The arrests began early this morning. 6.30 this morning, uh, police officers from Pressburg PD, uh, Kentucky Vehicle Enforcement, Kentucky State Police, and Pible Police Department started initiating a drug roundup of 14 people here in the Floyd County area. We actually have one out of Pike County. During an undercover investigation that we've been conducting for quite some time, they bought uh, pills, meth, heroin, and even some Suboxone. There was little connecting today's arrests, with some coming from tips by neighbors to others resulting from good old-fashioned police work. Some of it, they went out and they've heard about somebody and just started following them, watching them or whatever, and got buys off of them. Uh, some of it come from tips, and some of it come from uh, concerned neighbors who say, hey, look, let me show you what's going on. Okay. So, you know, it's getting to the point where people are tired of it. They've had enough of it. While today's action marks just the latest in a series of high-profile drug arrests, Mayor Stapleton says he believes he sees some light at the end of the tunnel. I deal a lot with the younger generation, high school type kids, and I am seeing less interest in drugs. Uh, they're finding more stuff to do. Uh, they're getting out. It seems like they're a little bit more active than the, than the, other, the older generation. So I, I think they're more educated on it, and they've seen the devastation from it. So I think we're actually seeing an improvement in the younger generations. Reporting in Prestonsburg, I'm Ralph Davis for EKB News.